Hello and welcome to Ubrica channel where we help build sustainable One Health communities through One Health clinics, produce and product value addition workshops as well as a retail store Soko Janja. My name is Kola Sikamugi and today we're going to tell you more about our retail store Soko Janja and in particular share with you our interactions with the local manufacturers based in Gongrod here in Kenya who are very excited about getting a market for all their quality products and with me today is a lovely guest with an interesting name Miss Kenyan Joroge who is from Atlanta Georgia and is going to share her experience from the interaction she had with the local manufacturers at Ngong Road and also be telling us more on why you should be joining the Soko Janja platform so Miss Kenya how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm very fine. Thank you. Good. So nice to see you. Me too. All right. So first of all, mm. we begin with your name, mm. Kenya. So why did your parents choose to call you Kenya? Um, my dad is the one that chose the name. Mm -hmm. And he chose it because as a daughter, I meant the world to him. Mm -hmm. And he, couldn't, he didn't want to name me the world. Mm -hmm. So he just named me his country. Wow. That is so amazing. That is nice. So now... Going on to your stay in here in Kenya, how what is your experience so far? How do you feel about your stay in Kenya? Um, I like it in Kenya. It's very different from America. Mm -hmm. Like um, the the people are different. Mm -hmm. The business is different. Mm -hmm. and a lot of things, but it's good. It's All good. right. Yeah. And how about the weather? Um, the weather here and there it's different too. Mm -hmm. um, at this time, mm -hmm. like June, July, yeah. it's summer in mm -hmm. Georgia, but mm -hmm. here it's winter. It's mm -hmm. not very, very cold because mm -hmm. there, when it's winter, it's cold, like it's very cold. Mm -hmm. And when it's summer, it's very hot. Oh, so, yeah. I see. Yeah. So welcome. This is a beautiful land mm. and we are glad to have you. Thank so you. going on to our topic today, mm. and uh, you visited Ngong Road. Mm -hmm. And uh, first of all, tell us, what was your main highlight during the visit? Um, something I found like that stood out to me mm -hmm. was that um, when we were interviewing one of the people because we were um, we were our task was to interview the owners of the businesses yeah. just to see their experiences mm -hmm. you know how they feel about the construction and things yeah so we were um, at this one business and we were interviewing the owner mm -hmm. of the business well what we thought was the owner of the business yeah and in the middle of the interview mm -hmm. the actual owner came mm -hmm. and beat him up because you know he oh. was just a fracker that didn't you know he didn't actually own the store he was uh -huh. looking for money you oh. know to steal his business so oh. he beat him up in front of us all right and yeah that was that was interesting to me oh i see mm. oh that 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 must be a broker mm. the guys who just purport to be owning the business yet yeah. they they have not put in any sweat I and that know. is quite unfortunate yeah. all right so let's go on to now there there have to be some good experiences that you had mm. so tell me what do you feel good about um the business people um i found that like all the businesses like mm -hmm. um they're very determined to work like mm -hmm. they're very like um, whether it's raining or very hot or very cold, mm -hmm. they're still working. They'll still push through it. Mm -hmm. So they're very determined. Mm -hmm. And um, also, like, um, from the experience of interviewing one of the owners yeah. of another place, mm -hmm. um, I found that they're very optimistic mm -hmm. about their future and the business mm -hmm. and, their, and the construction going on. Like, after the construction, they mm -hmm. think it's going to be good for them mm -hmm. and stuff like that, yeah. All right. So now, with the construction going on, mm. definitely... And this being an open air market, I understand mm. it's an open air market. Yes, yes, yes. So now, do you first of all, this is where we come in as Soko Janja. Mm. Tell me, do you think that the construction is actually distracting them from what you observed? Yes, very much. Because mm -hmm. um, on like as I was driving, I mean as we were going around, mm -hmm. I realized that on the right side, yeah, there's the road being built like right there in the midst of their business, mm -hmm. and the businesses i mean the markets that were right on the edge of this road yeah they were being pushed back all the way mm -hmm. so it's even hard for customers to go there mm -hmm. and people to park you know to go th to the businesses mm -hmm. so it must be hard for their business and their sales mm -hmm. yeah. so tell me um are these people excited about uh joining soko Janja? what do they think about this platform when now you told them about the platform um a lot of them well most of them are very ready to 
to um, have this online market mm -hmm. and just like for the um, opportunity to sell more stuff mm -hmm. they're very open to it yeah. all right mm -hmm. so you were able to recruit some of them yes we were able to recruit some of them. oh okay mm -hmm. and so now tell us um probably um some of there has to be some ugly experience that you had mm. and uh, what were those ugly experiences especially maybe being an open air market yes. did you find maybe things like sewage or something going on mm -hmm. um like when we came in mm -hmm. when we came into the road i yeah. could smell the sewage and then when i got outside i realized that the they're selling right next to the sewage. Some of people have even have their products on the sewage. On the <laughs> yeah, so it's even making it, you know, like unattractive. Uh -huh. And even like the furniture is very nice. Mm -hmm. It's very beautiful, mm -hmm. but like mm -hmm. for a customer, it's even hard to see the beauty when it's on this bad condition. Mm -hmm. Even there's trash on the roads mm -hmm. and mud. Mm -hmm. and yeah. All right. Mm. So we talk about now. Th there's so much distraction. The sewage. Mm. We have human traffic. Mm. So much. Uh, the traffic. The the car traffic is still so much. Yes. So now encourage. Tell us more on um, what these people need to do to now get themselves out of this situation. Are we telling them that Sokojanja is a place to be? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think Sokojanja is very like. A very good opportunity mm -hmm. for them mm -hmm. because they don't have to worry about this the sewage and the, the dirty roads and stuff like yeah. that mm -hmm. because um, um, even they can get more business because the cars that are coming mm -hmm. you know they're not really looking at the the sides of them they're worried about where they're going mm. but when you when it's an online market it's mm -hmm. there and it's even reaching a wider range of people mm -hmm. not just the people that are there mm -hmm. so like they can have more business there. Mm. Mm. and for even for this I, I tend to believe now from your experience mm. with these guys they'll have to avoid these guys who purport to own their own businesses because yes, there won't be any of that if it's online mm -hmm. so it's, it's their work it's their business mm -hmm. they can't have any fractures in all right yes. that is so good mm. and so we will be joining you soon or how long will you be do you intend to stay in the country um i'm leaving next week oh that is yeah. so sad <laughs> but oh, you're yeah. still part of the you yes. break a family yes. and i hope you go to there and tell them about our amazing products mm -hmm. that we have and even the soko janja team i mean the the retail store yeah. is there for everybody to see mm -hmm. and if so. they want anything you can actually take to to them i know <laughs> <laughs> yeah everybody in atlanta <laughs> tell them we have good great products yeah. and we will bring to them mm -hmm. and they can see it through sokojanja mm -hmm. whatever they need then you'll transport for us yes all right <laughs> thank you so much thank it you. was a pleasure having you thank you and i wish you safe journey mm -hmm. as you leave but then i know you're coming back yes, soon yes i will so our viewer will be expecting you mm -hmm. and we will host you immediately you come in. Yeah. You'll be our first guest <laughs> okay. here. Thank you for joining the You Breaker channel. Thank you. Yeah, and we'll see you soon. Mm -hmm. All right. Indeed, it is amazing what Sokojanja can do to change your life for the better. Because on this platform, we give you a chance to enjoy the fruits of your labor. Because we know how hard you work to produce your goods. And that is why we at Sokojanja are working round the clock to ensure that you have a ready market for your goods. So please join us on Sokojanja. Our website is shop.ubrika.com. And if you have any questions, you can give us a call on plus 2547 5584017. And that is all for, for now, guys. Please click subscribe and share with a friend this video if you like it. And we will see you next time. Blessings. Buying from Soko Janja, you get a chance to save a life of a child and a woman.